welcome to my new video which is based on Laplace transform. So let us suppose you have a function in terms of t. Then for ft the Laplace transform is given by L of ft which is equals to interval integration from the interval 0 to infinity of e raised to power minus st that function in terms of t. So here we go this is the formula for Laplace transformation. There are so many formulas like if you have to find out the value of Laplace transform sin at then it will be like this or cos like this and there are so many formula. How can we apply these formulas into particular equation or a question? So there is a form, question, a scenario. You have to find out the Laplace transform for this particular function. How can you transform it? Firstly, change a particular function into the linearity function, not in product form. So as it is in product form, so you have to apply sine and cos formulas so that it, it is changed, it will change into the positive or negative signs. Let us see what can we do. If we multiply it with 2 and divide it with 2, then you can see that this will form 2 sin a sin b. The formula for it is cos a minus b. a minus b is 2t minus 3t. That means minus t. And cos of minus t is also positive. Minus is in formula and cos a plus b. So cos a plus b becomes cos 5t. Now if you take, this is your function f in terms of t. If you take the Laplace transform thoroughly, then what will you get? Laplace transform of ft will become half linearity. Distribute the Laplace into the whole equation. Laplace transform of cos t minus Laplace transform of cos 5t. So, in this way, you will get, listen, compare this with the formula, cos at. If you see, if you compare it, then what will you see? That a is your 1, whereas in this formula, your a is 5. So, the formula becomes s over s square plus a square, a is 1 here, minus s, s square plus a square, which is 5 here. So, half of, you can take S as common, 1 by S square plus 1 minus 1 by S square plus 25. And in this way, if you solve it, then this is your LCM. This will come out into this, multiply S square plus 25 minus s square minus 1, s square is cancelled with s square. So 24s, 24 when cancelled with 2 is 12s, s square plus 1 and s square plus 25. I hope you understand this is how we can solve any particular function in terms of Laplace transform. In our next video, we will discuss about the sum of the few topics regarding Laplace transform. Till then, if you like my channel, then don't forget to subscribe it. Okay? And also share it. Thank you so much.